another episode, heck, another series of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is the ultimate Iron Man Challenge brought to you by um, Captain Adonis and Know-It-All DM. So they partner together to bring us this scenario. I am competing as a competitor in their Season Zero, which is sort of their test, uh, kind of a pre-season Let's let kind of, you know, kind of like a beta test for the scenario. Um, and so the rules are um, we can use any seed that we want. Apparently it doesn't matter. <clears throat> so I'm going to I'm going to set the name up here. Let's uh, so ultimate Iron Man challenge season zero uh, seed. Um, uh, I'll just close my eyes, slam it down on the number keyboard and see what happens. And here we go. Oh, I seem to have missed. No, I hit one key. <laughs> How could I miss? Oh, well, no, I didn't miss. I hit one key. There we go. Seven. Seven? Okay. <laughs> it doesn't matter. It do I don't think it matters, right? He said it doesn't matter, so... We could put seed one, I guess, but whatever. Let's go with seven. That was my random, my random uh, uh, drop of the finger down onto the number keypad and try and hit as many as possible. And I only apparently hit one um, with three fingers going down. Yeah, don't judge me. So this is supposed to be set to hard. Apparently, I just saw a video today that says that the um, settings were gimped up at the beginning somehow and people's even though that they set it to hard that it defaulted to medium on start and a bunch of people's starts were at medium setting you know what I don't care I don't care this is supposed to be done on hard I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna do it on hard uh, yeah I'm gonna restrict myself uh, everyone else is allowed to start on medium apparently um, well everyone's apparently now allowed to set start medium and then as soon as you um, land or whatever you gotta you know reset it to hard uh, and you can do that now by just going back into your your save game and selecting the difficulty setting and changing it um, so we have to make sure that everything is set on the default hard setting and all the true false settings are set to true so and yep yeah, that's all the nasty um, hard settings so this will be more of a test of how the scenario is actually going to stack up uh, for the for the start of next season, I guess. I don't even know if anyone else is even going to start with hard settings. I might be the only one. I might be the only one. But I think we somebody needs to. And you know what? I'll sacrifice my body uh, in the greater good of science. And here we go. <clears throat> um, so there we are, season zero. Uh, if, if you guys want to, uh, at home, you can also subscribe to uh, Know It All DM's scenario, the ultimate Iron Man season zero, and follow along with the competitors. Uh, I would suggest, you know, pick one of your favorite competitors, uh, um, and I'm going to have all of their info in the... Uh, listing down below the video so check out I'm gonna have all their links you can you can click on their link it'll take you to their site or their playlist for the um, season and and yeah if you if you like the seed that they're on you know use their seed run with them uh, but yeah please go check out all the other competitors and on that note to all my other competitors I wish you good luck and me may the Iron Men, step forward. Here we go. Ah, it's hard start. That means everything is going to impact us worse. Temperature, food, oxygen, although I think this was an oxygenated planet, so that's probably a moot point. Uh, although up in space, it'll consume it faster, I guess. I would think so, yeah. 
but I think at that point we'll be out of the survival stage. Okay. Needing oxygen. Oh, look at that, a satellite wreck right off the bat. And, ooh, a radiated biome. You know what, I'm gonna take a shot at going into the radiated biome right off the bat and see if I can uh, find any, like, um, Promethium stones because there's not gonna be any critters spawned, right? At least I don't think there would be. I didn't see, uh, I've only seen Know It All DM's video and uh, McMonster Dad's video starts, so. Look at that, there's a Promethium pellet. It looks like there's uh, cobalt, a couple of cobalt rocks. Nice. Okay. And we're gonna be radiated and cooking right away too, so we can't stay in here long. Yeah, look at that, wow. Okay, so where is this stuff? I'm just gonna launch my drone really quick here. I know it's like before we even do anything here, I am launching my drone. Oh, you know what? We better actually grab the stuff out of here. So no Robson protocol, that's fine. Launch my drone and we are going to grab, where is it? I saw a stone here. I'm just gonna get my stats back here, that's fine. So we have a survival tool, I'm gonna equip that and select that. And then I'm gonna select rock mode. And I go in, you can see the temperature, our body temperature is climbing really fast in here. We can't stay in here. We can't stay in here. This is, this is death. This is gonna be death. You know what? Let's just run over to that pick and grab it. Let's just run over to it. Where, where is it now? I thought I, where is it? It's over here. Even if I just get a little bit of Promethium, it's gonna be enough. I only need a couple of chunks to give me enough to, uh, to make like a, a multi-tool charge. And that's really all I'm really concerned about at this point. Okay, there we are. We're out of the nasty environment. Okay, what did that yield us? We got uh, three cobalt and three promethium. Totally worth it. Uh, we're no worse for the wear. We got 0.1 radiation. The very first time I actually eat something that should go away. Uh, in the meantime, I'm just going to grab a little bit of wood here really quick. Two logs, not much. That's okay. We can we can deal with some more logs later. Uh, there's some copper over here. I need to grab that. There's the satellite wreck. We're gonna go check that out. Um, and Nodal VM gave a little hint away in his video, which I will disclose to you guys. Um, which you probably already picked up anyway. He mentioned that. Oops, I'm on the wrong thing. Walk drill. Um, he mentioned that there is a monument. So let's take a look. There is a monument somewhere on the planet. Oh, there it is down there. And there we go. UIM Champion Monument. So what I want to do is I'm going to waypoint that and so is that, that's west of us? That's west. Oh, perfect. You know what? That's actually, okay, that's our beacon. That's the way we're heading. We're just gonna check out the satellite wreck first. Um, I'm gonna need to probably grab, oh, there's some copper in the forest there too. Don't see any food yet. So on hard settings, I think even like the food and like ground rocks, I think are even more scarce. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna have even a tougher time than, than the other people not starting on hard, which is fine. Cause this is the, what, this is what Noah all DM originally intended. So this is how I'm gonna test it for him, right? Right? This is a test for the Iron Man community. see if it's actually doable. You can see my temperature right now is a little bit below um, comfortable temperatures and that's okay. It's only a slightly below. It's not going to impact us too, too much. You notice that they remove the um, 
stamina requirements for the survival tool. So now it doesn't actually take up stamina to use, which is good. There we go, level two. We need one more level. Level three is the optimal level for us. Level three will get us a portable constructor. Uh, and from there, we can actually, you know, pretty much build our world. But we can't do it without a portable constructor, really, unless we find somewhere else. So the goal is to hit level three pretty quick and gather resources on the way. So I'm kind of glad that that's to the west, to tell you the truth. That, that works out really well. Uh, I don't know if anyone knows this, but in the game, there's a bit of a, I won't call it an exploit, um, because it's really not. It's a game mechanic, and that is time. But you can, you can buy more time, let's say, um, by actually moving west. It'll slow time down if you're moving west. If you're moving west quite fast, you can actually keep up with time. If you move very fast, you can actually get ahead of time and catch up to the sun and even past the sun <laughs> and go into the previous day. I think, uh, I, I think at one point you actually, once you hit that center line, it flips the next day anyway, right? You actually flip forward a day, I think, isn't it? It's like you completely miss a whole day if you do that. So it looks like the temperature is going to be relentless. We're going to need to really figure that out hard. So I got to get into a um, lower elevation to drop the temperature. And we got to get out of the grassland, I think. We might be able to get into the forest area more. <clears throat> you can see my temperature is dropping. I don't currently have the levels or the means to build a heater. So we could be looking at death within minutes here. Oh, 14. I just got to find a place that goes back up to like 15. Uh, even if it's just for a split second, it can bounce my temperature back up. Keep going down, maybe. There we go, 15. <clears throat> but we do want to make it over to the west. I will keep to the lowlands to do that, though. And the lowlands look like they're going to be marshlands anyway, so. Let's grab this stuff. really need silicone and iron and all we've really got is copper and food so far but I really need third level can't make the constructor without third level without the constructor we can't do anything can't make a drill um, can't make a motorcycle and actually I do actually intend to make a motorcycle, I think, because that's like 14 kilometers away, so. Okay. Let's keep picking some vegetables here really quick. I, I know I'm down, in, but I, I do want to get a bunch of XP right off the bat. And the other thing, too, is I want to make sure I got enough food, because if I do start getting cold, uh, it's going to sap my stamina which is going to sap my food so i'm going to have to have food to keep that up okay i would like to have some um surface rock resources please please and thank you you can usually find a little bit in the swamp some copper or silicone sometimes even Actually, you can find all three usually. Uh, there we go. There's some copper. Seems copper isn't as hard to find. 
Well, at least copper is the easiest so far because that is the hardest to make out of stone. But that's a moot point if we don't find any silicone or iron because, yeah, without silicone and iron ore, we can't make the constructor anyway to turn the stone into ore. <laughs> Unless we find a POI with a constructor. Now, as I was mentioning before, um, know it all DM eluded or no, outright said that there are POIs around the Champion Monument. So, if there's POIs uh, to gear up, uh, I think he said they were, he wanted to go check it out right away. So I'm assuming they're like neutral, easy to loot, like civilian POIs or something. There we go, level three, okay. So, good. Oops, let's just pick everything. Pick everything. So while we're while we're going along, I'm gonna get stuff constructing here. I'm gonna start getting some food going. Since we've got we're starting to pick some stuff. It's kinda cool that I picked up some plastic on that, but plastic is a lot easier to make now. Once you get the portable constructor, you can make it. Like one one grain is all you need to make like 20 plastic. So it's, and grain's a lot easier to find now just by picking it in the, everywhere in the swamps. Okay, I don't want to get too close to that guy. I know he's not a hostile, but I think he has potential to become hostile if he doesn't like what I'm doing. Like, so if so if I'm like, you know how the crickets, they get all aggro on you if you break rocks or trees around them. If you're really close to them, they'll actually attack you. Or potentially, they, they might come at you. They don't always necessarily hit, but they make the attack motion. And sometimes they do hit. And when they do, they can pop you for about 100 points damage, which hurts, but it's not that bad. It's not the damage that screws you up. It's their... They can poison you. You know what? I'm going to stay up high here. We've got 18 degrees. And usually up in the mountains here, we can get silicone. So I want to... Now, I don't know. This is this is obviously a custom scenario completely. So um, I don't know. Know it all DM might have completely changed how the... Uh, where all the... Uh, uh, deco, all the deco and everything, but it looks very normal so far. It looks like a normal temperate starter planet. Like Akua or, or like Talador. Um, those are, I just named those specifically. I mean, even though that they are from the uh, default Akua Omicron scenario. This kind of reminds me of that, to tell you the truth. There was no Robson protocol. Um, I'm actually curious to see if there's PDA missions. Yeah, the, 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 the normal stuff. So you know what? Let's, um, let's do the collect delicious green eating. We might as well. If it's going to give us free stuff, let's do it. Okay, we got a copper deposit. That's good. Um, not that it does us any good because we can't actually use it. So, <laughs> uh, okay, I see some stones over there. God, hope some, hopefully they're resource rocks and not just stones. Okay, there's some copper. Is that silicone? Please be freaking silicone. Good. Okay. Oh, let's just drone it up there. It's going to be faster. And is that a... No, that's a nothing. <laughs> and that's resource over there, though. And resource. So I'm going to go up and then down a bit, I think. 
just to try and get these rocks here. God, now I got any iron yet? Nope. Copper, some silicone. So I got enough silicone now to make the, uh, I need some copper. I need copper. Uh, not copper, uh, iron. Sorry. I need some iron. If I, if I find some iron, I can start making the, um, Are you guys? You guys are all just regular stone. Nope, that's silicone. Good. Okay, let's just fly up here really quick to see. Get a good look at these things. So that's silicone. So only so. Oh, there's a drone over there. Why is there a drone over there? And it's coming my way? Are you kidding me? It's coming over the mountain? Is it coming at me? It's coming at me. Holy crap. Okay. Uh, run, 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 run. I'm screwed. I am so, so screwed. He's coming at me. I'm going to run out of stamina. Oh, this isn't fair. He was like 400 kilometers, or 400 meters. Ah, oh, this isn't fair. Oh, he's... Oh, he left. <laughs> oh, thank God. What the hell? Whew. I thought, I thought that was it. That, that was it. I saw my life flash before my eyes there. <laughs> I got no gun. I got no way of even making a gun. <sighs> okay, let's try this again. I had to run away. <laughs> it's okay. Run away to live another day. I was, I was a little worried because I was out in the open. I couldn't even hide from him. <laughs> It's like, oh God. Whew. Okay, I am awake. Are you awake now, boys and girls? I'm awake now. All right. Iron Man, here we are. And is that iron? Or, no, silicone, that's okay. I'll, I'll take the silicone. I mean, if I can find any more, like, if I, if I have to, I'll go back to that freaking satellite wreck and, oh, I didn't even check it. God, I should have checked it. <sighs> That's sad. Didn't even check it. <laughs> I'm so excited. Just run, run into the forest. Okay. You know what? Let's grab some of these anyway. We might have to turn them in an eye to iron if we can find enough iron to actually make a. Uh... Oh my! This is looking bleak. Why am? It's okay. I'll... Is this silicone? No. <sighs> That's okay. That's okay. I haven't found any iron yet, but that's okay. We are now getting down into... Okay, so it's getting a little cold. We're going to have to go down. Oh, there's a whole bunch of copper, though. I can't just leave it. All right, copper. 
I'm coming for you. Silicone? No. It looks so close to silicone from afar, but it's far from good. It's good from afar, but far from good. Okay. I've met some people from that like that. Um, yeah. Let's check out down here before we freeze. Because, yeah, you know, 14 degrees, we can die. <laughs> Heck, I'd barbecue in 14 degrees. For you, the, for those of you that follow Fahrenheit, that would be multiply it by two and add 32. So 14 degrees times two is 28 plus 32 is 60. You got it. 60 degrees Fahrenheit will kill you in the game. <laughs> I know, it's funny. I guess it's exposure. <laughs> I really, really, really need to find some iron. Like, I'm getting desperate here now. I just need one frickin' rock, I think, and I can make the constructor, two rocks, and I can make the constructor in the, uh, and, uh, like, bike. I'm gonna head out of here, because we're, like, freezing again. Oh, yay! Natural stimulant! Okay. Am I gonna have to head east now? I don't want to head east. I gotta keep heading west. I gotta keep pushing west. That's going to speed up day for me. <sighs> this isn't good, though. I'm having a tough time finding any... Okay, so there's sand coming up. Um, we need plains. That's what we need. We need, like, grassy plains. Okay, so there's some copper over here. Bunch of copper over there too. And really, the time is starting to run down here, and I haven't even found one. Oh, there's copper right here. I haven't even found one iron. Found a couple of copper deposits, and uh, it's just so. This is going to be super hard. I am not going to get the resources I need by the end of 24 hours. I'll be lucky to even get a freaking motorcycle up at this point. Well, the seed could be screwing me with no iron rocks or I don't know. Okay, so this looks like fields up ahead here. Please give me some freaking iron rocks. And we're constantly freezing, it seems like. <laughs> Water over here. We've got swamp over there, but I really need. Although iron can be in swamp, I've actually found quite a bit of iron in swamp. Now that I think about it, that might not be a bad idea. Let's go there. Yeah, because if I can get a constructor up, I can turn stone into silicone if I'm if I'm too short on it, right? So, but without a constructor, I can't do nothing. I am screwed. So I need iron. And these are all just regular frickin' stones. Oh, 
I need resource rocks real bad. I almost don't have the time to stop and smash any of those. And it's pointless too. I need iron to make the constructor. I didn't loot any, did I already? And I'm just derping? No. Okay, stuff's starting to spoil. I'm going to eat something here. Um, I guess we can try and pick more food. Yeah, I won't even be able to make like a starter base if I don't find iron. I mean, nothing. I'll be screwed. I'll be dead. Oh, I won't be dead. It's just... Got to find iron. This is crazy. This, nope, that's copper. It's almost all of day one gone, and I have not found one iron or in rock yet. Wow. This is pretty bleak. Silicone, yay. <sighs> Normally iron is not the issue. Normally iron is just frickin' everywhere. Oh, 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 iron, iron, iron. My first iron rock. Uh, deep into it. Oh, my goodness. Please give me lots. Ooh, that gave me six, didn't it? Four. Oh, it might be enough. Three, two, and one. Yes, it will be. Okay, so let's crack that open. Get into is it miscellaneous. Yes, portable constructor. We'll unlock that. We'll we'll unlock the heater too. Might as well. Okay. So what do we got for resources? Not much. Not much. That's why there's not much showing up. Okay. That's fine. So now that we've unlocked that, let's make it. Woo! We finally got our portable constructor going. Whew. And I'll be able to make the heater cooler. I think I need to do that. Or, hmm. I won't be able to make the motorcycle. I'll make the heater cooler. I think I might need that more than the motorcycle at this point. I just need to find a couple more iron rocks and we'll get a motorcycle up and running. This is choosing to be very, 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 very difficult to find resources, though. Oh, there's a rock over there. Actually, let's just spawn the drone really quick and take a quick bird's eye view. Uh, if there's any other rocks around that we can quickly see, no. So we're going to go get this one, and then... Keep heading west. Oh crap, did I aggro that guy? He got stressed over it. Let's run. Let's just run. Head west. Well, how much did I get? Four. It's not enough. I need five. <sighs> tough it's almost nightfall and we've barely got a constructor up and going if I can get a motorcycle this will speed things up a lot oh this will do it okay let's get this going here And we're screwing around. So we already got 66 copper. That's pretty good. Hey, motorcycle time. Gimme. Mm, I don't have quite enough to make a, uh, a drill, do I? No. It's okay. It's okay. Well, it's doing that. Let's cut down some trees really quick. Because we're going to need more biofuel. Uh, I think these shorter ones are easier to cut down. Okay. Okay, let's probably 
probably no, it's probably not ready, right? Everything's on slow. Oh, you know what? I wasn't paying attention to see if how much XP I was getting when I was grabbing plants. 100. So it did reset the medium again. Ah, crap. Well, I, I tried know-it-all. I tried. I tried. I, uh, um, I don't know what to say. I guess we're all forced to start at medium and then we just switch it once it's created, right? So, oh well. Uh, so if that's the case, that means I'm not being affected as hard as I should be. So you know what? I'm going to log off. Log back in. So we're going to resume game and we're going to switch the difficulty to this back to hard. I tried. I tried. I truly tried. Um, that's kind of funky. Anyway, I guess we're all going to be starting on an even playing field then. Oh well. I mean, that's the way it's normally supposed to be, but we, we're really supposed to be on hard. So now my food consumption start, should start dropping a lot faster. And 51 XP. I should have, I should have checked that right away. Oh well, I only got to level three, I think, didn't I? Yeah, I only got to level three. Not, not a big, not a big deal. Okay. So now that we have a motorcycle, woohoo! A motorbike. We can get going here. Um, what do we got here? So we're going to have to go a little bit to the north as we head. Okay, that's fine. Now what I like to do is I like to tab. I like to alt out and drive with the camera a little bit higher. I tend to be able to see things a little better, I, I find. Now we need to catch up to the sun to be able to see, period. Looking for stones. Right here. I stop for stones. I definitely stop for stones. And let's turn my shoulder light on. Oh, look at that, a couple stones. So because there's two, a couple stones really close, I'm just going to launch my drone then. And switch to uh, rock drill. Okay, we'll have enough to make a drill now. Excellent. Let's just keep going. We're not going to stop. We're not stopping now. We're just... We're just traveling. We only stop for rocks now. We've already hit level 3, so we only stop for rocks. And let's tab. Let's alt out so I can see a little better. Avoid the large trees, you can't drive through the large trees. Not regular stones, I want rocks. I want resource rocks. We gotta catch up to the sun here. I can't see. And it's getting awfully cold. It's a good thing I made that heater. Look for rocks, not crappy little ones. <laughs> and there's a drone over there. Oh, crap. I 
I've probably passed a whole bunch of resource rocks already that I couldn't see. You know what? Let's just nut it. Let's just let's just put our foot to the floor and try and get some light again here. Whoa. seeing much in the way of resource rocks. Still need everything. Need a lot of copper for uh, for like shotgun shells and and like the pistol ammo and stuff. So that can be pretty important. You can see we've gotten back to the Ooh, stone. Gaining time back now. That's how you do it. You jump on a motorcycle and you can keep up, or well, you can you can actually catch the sun on a motorcycle. You can't on foot unless you always run, I think. But then you'd run out of stamina, so it's it's not doable. probably drive driven past a whole bunch haven't I and you guys have been like oh you passed six iron already uh, I know I suck whoa hmm looks like we're swimming looks like we're swimming which way is the shortest way oh there's a land bridge over there so let's just get off Bridge over here. I can use. Oh, got to be careful jumping down a hill. You can break a leg. Okay, let's get back on the bike here. Stuff won't start spawning till the morning. Like uh, predators, I should say. So, ooh, what's this? Is that nothing? No. Okay. No resource rocks there. stopping to pick stuff. You guys are probably all, hey, come on. You can 
be level five by now. Yeah, I don't care. I don't care. I only wanted level three. I don't care about player progression. I just want materials. seems easy peasy because it's just freaking everywhere. But I don't need a crap ton. Realistically, I need like maybe 40 of each ore and I can make uh, a decent little starter HV. in the immediate vicinity that I can see apparently okay let's keep going so what are we at there I picked up 14 that's that's pretty good I don't like the sound of that thing let's go oh I'm gonna hit a tree okay uh, do I attempt to cut down this tree sure let's see it's a big tree Motorbikes are rocking. Guess I shouldn't come and knock. See if we need to go driving in another direction. Uh, I just can't see. Is that iron over there or copper? That looks like iron way over there. And that looks like copper over there. Uh, let's get that. More of that. Eat one of those. Okay. Okay. Looked like there was. Was this iron or copper? That is copper. Crap. Okay, it looked like there was an iron rock over. Oh, there's a copper node. Be 
nice if it was an iron node. If I find a silicone or iron deposit, I'm going to mine it. I'm going to make a uh, drill with some biofuel and mine it. But in the meantime, we got to head west. And whoa. It's a wheelie train. That was a copper. We're looking for iron rocks. I just can't see. It looks like there's something here. Looks like there's an iron rock over there. So... To our left and skirt the mountains, I guess? I don't know. It's, it's getting cold. That's okay. I'm going to make this night last by continuing to head west. And what have we got? Iron and copper? Nice. Since I'm right here, I'll take the copper, of course. I mean, come on. <laughs> There's another one over there. All this stuff. Uh, line over to oh, a couple more nice okay I'm, I'm starting to feel a little better about this now we have 47 we're almost up to uh, that would give us uh, 90 not bad not bad that would be enough but I still want more obviously rocks. Even a deposit would be really nice about now. I've probably passed a bunch. You guys have probably seen a ton of them. For some reason, it's easier to see sometimes the videos than <laughs> see the person playing the game. Oh, that was a nothing. Just a regular stone. So we'll just in the general direction of the monument, I think. Oh, silicone. <laughs> that I smashed into. Let's just do it quick. stop and start picking this stuff now I guess um, but I really want to get to this monument now so I'm curious to see what uh, know-it-all DM would, was talking about Trees. Ooh. 
Stop, stop, stop. Don't go in the water, please. Okay. Let's keep working away through these canals here, or whatever you want to call them. Is this a land bridge here, or am I going to be swimming? Oh, hello! Uh, it's too bad they wouldn't help me out. In fact, there's a mission to actually kill them. <laughs> Natural sweetener and mushrooms and berries. thats I should actually be paying attention to that, right? I could actually potentially finish this mission and go on to another one. I don't know why I'm hopping the whole way. I think I was... Oh, there's mushrooms. I mean, we've still got pretty good time because we made up time by heading west. We made up a frickin' ton of time, actually. Okay, let's get back into the marshland area here. And keep going. Do I need berries, natural sweetener? Get lucky with a berry tree. I see st oh wait is that sweetener over there what is that oh it's a flower it's a glowing flower uh, come on resource rocks they're just not rocking right now they're not rocking it or at least I'm not rocking it. One of us ain't. What else do I need? I need uh, natural sweetener and berries. Oh, I'll take that for the shiz and giggles. And that silicone up there. So let's go grab that. And then we'll jump on the bike again here. I don't want to dally anymore. If I see berries or natural sweetener, I'll stop and pick them. Right now, it's silicone and iron is our focus for the most part, and it looks like, what is that, copper? Copper. It's okay. It's okay. I'll still grab it. Okay, so, let's have a good feeling about this chunk of swamp. I think we're going to find some more resource rocks in here. There's a couple of silicone. There's a bunch of silicone. Okay, good. Yep, there's silicone around. Okay. Okay, let's grab it. Or was it? It was over here, right? Wasn't it? Isn't there a couple things of silicone I thought I saw over here? Is it way over? Am I just hallucinating? I was hallucinating. Oh my god. <laughs> must have been the freaking... I don't know, I guess the, uh, the fungi or whatever it is, the moss looked like 
look like uh, rocks from a distance, whatever. Whatever, I suck. Yeah, see, I, I thought that was a resource rock. I thought both of these were. I thought they were silicone. Kind of looked like it from a distance. My bad. Whatever. Sue me. Okay, let's keep going. Let's get our bike back down. We're starting to... Get into time here now, so I want to really make use of my time. Oh. Can't, through, can't run through that deco. rocks. I know you exist. They're just, oh, there's one. I think that just brought us up to 42, so that would be 80 units. Okay, so we really need iron. Iron is the big limiting factor at this point. That was copper back there. I'm just not going to stop. Iron now seems to be our limiting factor, and we're really not finding it. rocks on the beach it seems except for the occasional silicone oh that's a big score that was actually a couple big chunks Fifty-eight. Oh, nice. Okay. A couple more would be up to sixty. That would give us a one twenty in ingots, which is, which will be enough. I think. I think we're gonna be okay. We're doing pretty good on time. How's our silicone doing now? Forty-six. That will be ninety. Oops. Yeah, it's, it's two ingots per ore of uh, most of the um, basic resources. Okay, so we're, our basic ores, I should say. So what's this here? Copper things? Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll grab it since I smashed into it. Iron deposit. 
that would be epic right now, and I earned a deposit. <laughs> yeah, hopes and dreams. I haven't got any deposits except for a couple of copper ones at this point. That's a pretty flower. They're pretty flowers. You can grow those now, which is cool. berries. Any of these trees got berries? Berries? Is that berries there? There's berries. Isn't it? No. Are you berries? No. It looked like it can it kind of looks like berries from distance and then when you get closer it's like no, those aren't berries. They're just wood. Okay, that's okay. We'll find a berry bush. We'll find a berry bush. We can get unstuck from this honey. Oh my goodness. Really? The deco has that much of a hitbox? Okay, so... We're getting... Re Ooh, what is that over there? What is that over there? Check it out. It looks like a POI. Really? No resource rocks at all? All just moss? Shuttle hub. Okay. Mining hub. Woo! Shuttle hub and a mining hub. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. And level four. <laughs> How exciting. I still got nine hours. Oh man, I am doing okay. I'm doing okay. I'm not going to jinx myself. I'm not going to stay great. I'm just okay. We're not out of this yet. We're actually just barely into it. Okay. Um, it would be nice for residents too, wow. Hmm. Let's see, mining hub, shuttle hub, the mining hub, really good chance of armor. Shuttle hub, shuttle hub has an advanced constructor and fridges. I'm gonna go light loot the other POIs and bring it all to the uh, shuttle hub. Although the mining hub is nice and sealed. Mm. I don't know what to do now. You know what? We're here. Let's loot this one. Let's loot this one. We're here. I think I'll just bring it over to the mining hub. If I need to, I can always come over and use the advanced constructor, I think, and the armor locker. It looks like a super fat, <laughs> short little drive. I'm sure we can handle it. so that we can uh, carry more stuff. Okay. Okay, um, I don't 
really have space for any food, although I can eat food. So let's just eat some. I'll, eat, I'll drink your milk too. Watch it poison me. They poison me. Uh, pills. Okay. Oh. And a booster. Huh? Okay. A, a thermal booster. Gotta have armor to put that on, but hey, that's okay. Okay, I don't care about their food. Let me just grab this stuff. Yeah, that's good. Good. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna have to come back. I'm gonna have to go dump all this off. So let's take a look at what's in here. And nice, medium armor. We can put that on right, like, right away. Since the armor locker's right here. And we can put the boost on it, too. <laughs> this is awesome! Man, halfway through day one, I've already got medium armor. And a booster on it for temperature. Although, what does that do? Heat protection, armor minus 30. Heat and cold protection, though. I don't think it's going to get minus 20. Yeah, I don't need it. I don't need the booster. Although it does take up a slot, so I might as well <laughs> carry more. Oh my. Um, I guess I could core it. I'll come back for that. Just grab the stackables. Hmm. Didn't have any biofuel made yet. That's cool. Uh, magnesium. Is that buds? Yeah, I don't care. Nice. Okay. That just allowed us to... Oh, yeah. We're going to do good here. We're going to do good, good, good. And... give up here. We can throw away. We don't really need a lot of the food stuff. So let's go put that in one of the fridge. Let's just leave it in the fridge for now. I don't need any of that f food stuff besides what I've made in protein bars. on me. Yeah. Okay. A little bit more space here. Okay. Oops. All this stuff. Actually, here, let's that into there. Good, we'll have some biofuel right off the bat. It'd be nice to like find a drill or something. And <laughs> be like, yay, don't even need to make a drill. Why do I keep looking in that box? Oh, there we go, a multi-tool, nice. Oh, whoa. Um, I just heard I just heard a night raptor. They're spawned already? Oh, come on. I don't even have any weapons. Okay, I'm going to make a beeline over for the mining hub then. Because that's all sealed up. Okay, so how do I do that? Where was the mining hub? Where's the mining hub? It's over there, right where the frickin' dude is. Okay, so... Really? They've already got critter spawn? I think I went too far then, right? Did I go too far around the world? And, like, jump into the next day? I've never done that before. That is... That'll be a first. 
or this scenario ignores the, the normal standards and stuff spawns a lot sooner here. Whatever. Yeah, I can't get that. <laughs> Why is he trying? Oh, okay, I am out of space. So what we're going to do is we're just going to dump all our ore into here. All our ore. That's it. That's it for ore. Okay. Okay. And then, let's just get out of here. And we can turn that on. And that'll smelt all of our ore and ingots for us for free. Woohoo! Okay, while it's doing that, let's go check out the rest of this place. Oh, yes! Night vision! That's awesome. And there's a dude I can buy and sell stuff from. So that's good. Let's go into defense mode just, just in case there's something around. Now there is a fridge here, I believe. Right? Yeah, so... Oh! It spoiled. Oh no, it didn't. There it is. That's because hey, my energy bar is spoiled. What? Uh, speaking of, I'll eat one right now. And how is the ones that I made there? They're ready to be stowed too. So, okay. We're okay on food. We're not going to use up a ton of food here. Um, and then if we get into trouble, we can rush over to the residences. There's a whole bunch of gardens in the residences from what I remember. So... Nice. I'll just keep getting all this stuff here. That's excellent. Awesome. Getting fuel and boosters and stuff. Okay, so let's put our ingots and craftable material in here. Okay, oh, some more ingots. Just... Spice, crystal, and torn. Okay, so we can put some crushed stone in there. Uh, what else we got here? Let's get these off my bar. It goes in there. So that goes in the fridge. Okay. Let's just go put that in the fridge before it spoils. Then we'll get to looting. But I'm going to call this my home, so, because uh, I'm just going to reorganize what I already 
am gonna eventually own anyway. Nice, couple of armor boosts. Wow, we're rocking on the boosts already. Be nice to get a tier two multi tool <laughs> off the bat. Okay. Uh, you know what? Let's check these ones out. Oops. That was that one? Power coil. Um, minigun. I'm not going to be able to use that. Pistol round. I can make a pistol. So that's doable. Let's get that on us. Since we have three multi charges and a couple more multi tools, we'll be probably. Yeah, let's put those away. We can put. We'll keep that. Dermal burn. Ooh. Nasty bugs will cause dermal burn. Do we have anything else to get rid of dermal parasite? Do we have anything else to get rid of dermal burn though? That's it, just one. So I can get hit once by those spitty bugs. Yikes. Actually, I don't need all that stuff. So we're gonna just stole all that stuff. Yeah, okay. Well guys, I am going to call the episode here. Oh, you know what? No, I'm not going to call it here. I'm going to finish looting for you guys, and then I'll call the episode. Because <laughs> up here is some good loot. Up here is some worth anything decent usually is. very decent so far. <laughs> kind of just run in the mill, really. Wow, completely run in the mill. Oh okay, yeah, well, whatever. Um, hmm. Let's stuff it away. Put that in there and that in there, too. Might as well. Put that in there. Okay, so now I'm going to find myself a cargo box. Or you know what? Let's, um... HV starter. Copper, silicone, iron. Cheap, cheap, cheap. Uh, level three, it has guns on it, and a, yeah, that'll work, it doesn't have much else though, but I can make more stuff and throw it on, so let's send that to the factory, and we'll just throw these multi-tools in there, flashlight in there, probably throw the minigun rounds, <laughs> Uh, it's probably, I could probably go smash the core on the other place and multi-tool it now that I got a multi-tool and a bunch of charges and probably get enough gear to actually spawn in the, um, uh, HV from it. I could be careful if I step out here. There's stuff out there.
If it gets upset with me, I'm running back inside. Come on. Really? Nice. Nice. Okay, so let's close that. Um let's put the stuff away. Got some good boosts. Okay, so for now I'm gonna just choose I'll do the bottom green one as my main storage. Okay. Let's go grab the ingots from the furnace. That should be all done by now. Did I look in here already? Yeah, I did. And we'll make a core. We'll, um... Nice. That's really good. And, oh, wow! I just noticed we are, like, right beside the water. That... Oh, right! We're, like, on a beach! We're on the beach! <laughs> this is, okay, I'm definitely taking this place over now. Oh, my goodness. Okay. I can multi-tool all this crap down. Because I won't need all that crap. Fix the space up. Get an HV going. I think we're doing pretty good here. Doing pretty good. Okay, so let's make a core. Now the problem is, as soon as I core this place, I'm going to be using my own fuel at this point. So, ooh. Mm. I wonder if I should get the HV up and going first. Because, I mean, really, I mean, what, do I need to own it at this point? I don't know if I actually need to own it. But we'll, we'll have the core anyway. Um, so I think realistically, what I would, what I think I'm going to do then is I'm just going to make, you know what, I'll throw, I'll, I'll use it. I'll use it. That's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to make a bunch of crap and throw it into the Yeah, that requires quite a bit of stuff. So if I make like a couple of those. And while that's crafting, I'll throw this stuff in here. God, the, <laughs> the core was almost a third of the amount of copper needed. Okay, that's funny. Come on. Oh, yeah. Fast crafter speed. Yay. Although, with the advanced constructor, hmm, maybe I will pop the core in the other place and take that stuff. That's what I'll do. I'll pop the core in the other place. Yeah, so let's make the core again. <laughs> Okay, how am I going to pop the core? I need a gun. Okay, I guess I should spec into one. Shotgun. Assault rifle. Tools. We'll, we'll do a multi-tool so that we can um, make more charges. 
Uh, or scanner is probably a good idea. Um, I need to take the Gatling gun so I can take make 15 mil bullets. What else? Let's unlock the fridge so that we can make one when it spawns in. We're going to need to replace headlights as they get blown off. Three points left. Oh, I can't make a detector. Uh, what about base? What can I do for base? Four. Cost four. Plant grow lights two. Who processor three. Need one over here. Yeah, okay. Although I could pop the ones off. Ah, that was a waste of three points. Whatever. Whatever. We can make a gun and some ammo at this point. So that's what we're going to do. I, oh, I need a drill too. Let's make a drill. We're going to make a gun. We're going to make a shotgun. And then we're going to make that many bullets and that many shotgun shells. Come on. See how slow crafting is on hard? Uh, I mean, re realistically, I could use the... Uh, I could try and use my tent and then speed all that up, but eh, it's not much. Although, you know what? That sounds like a freaking awesome an awesome idea. I've already got spawn stuff coming in. I'm not going to be going out anymore this night because of raptors spawning already. I couldn't believe that. I still had like seven minutes left or something. Of the of the first night, that was quite unbelievable. Anyway, um, yeah. Let's put that in here. Ten minutes. Okay. Okay. Uh, I think, I think we need to risk it. I've got medium armor on now. It's not like I'm a complete freaking wimp. Come on. Come on. Really? Okay. So, I'm going to call the episode here. Next episode, we will be uh, butt-rushing the shuttle hub and stripping it down. We're going to pop the core, and we're going to take the a bunch of the good parts out of it and multi-tool down as much as possible to potentially just spawn our HB outright and drive that back over here. So, stay tuned. Until then, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.